Hello everybody. My name is Paul Asbell and I play various styles of blues guitar as well as other things. Teach it a lot. And uh, I'm here at Dream Guitars with Paul Hugh Miller. Last night I played a, uh, a great house concert and uh, afterwards Paul and I were sitting around as musicians tend to do and he asked me a question about various thumb techniques uh, for various blues tunes and it got me thinking about a way to just give an overview of the several different techniques that uh, blues guitarists tend to use, or at least I tend to use, when I'm playing different blues tunes. Uh, I kind of tend to think of them in three categories, and what we're going to do today is run down several of those categories for you. Hope you have a good time. I'm going to play for you a tune that's based on the style of John Hurt. In fact, I make no bones about the fact that I call this tune uh, putting the hurt on you, for obvious reasons. Very, very similar to a number of John Hurt's tunes, and if you know his, uh, his tunes, you'll know that this is an awful lot like some of the tunes like uh, Ain't Nobody's Business and several others. Uh, at any rate, I'm going to play it, and uh, we're going to talk a little bit about the, the uh, thumb approach, which of course is an alternate thumb approach. basic right hand posture for uh, what I like to do when I'm playing it. You may notice, number one, I got a thumb pick. You don't have to. I don't even know if John, John Hurt did. I suspect he didn't. But I like to. And I also like to get a little bit of right hand muting in. So you may notice the karate chop part of the hand is kind of on the saddle, maybe going about a half inch or so into the string. So instead of sounding like that, there's nothing wrong with it, but this sounds like that. I just prefer the sound. This is the basic pulse and the basic alternation that this tune uses. But sometimes, for example, on the F, you don't have quite a complex an alternation pattern. every alternate thumb tune is a bit of a duet. The thumb's got its part, the fingers got their part. And so what I'm recommending you do is actually kind of break it down into two component parts. Uh, could be bar by bar, could be four bars at a time, could be the entire song, but what you're asking your thumb to do is you're saying, can you play just the thumb part of this tune all by itself? Because thumb, if you can't do that really well, I don't know how you're going to kind of put the whole thing together. So at any rate, that would be the way in which to work at not only this tune, um, but any John Hurt or by extension uh, any alternate thumb type tune. Try to get the thumb all by itself first. I've included the tab of this tune, so uh, you intrepid folks who want to kind of get the thing down, it's all there for you. Good luck with it. <laughs> 